from what I've been seeing, from what I've just heard from these different clips and whatnot, legitimately, legitimately, Chad, okay? It's because people weaponize their communities so hard. And people need to stop that, bro. It's crazy, dude. Like, like right now, I have some days where I talk shit in character and I know I'm going to go into my meta chat later and I'm going to tell people to calm the fuck down. You know what I'm saying? I got to make it obvious that I'm still okay with John Law so that people know that I'm not trying to shit on the ball as OOC or anything like that, right? But people just keep weaponizing their chats like it's some fucking gang warfare on Twitch, bro. I'm serious. Everybody do it, man. And then this... I'm sorry, okay? I, I know there are some people on the vibe like they want, don't want to report. I'll never do that, blah, blah, blah. Even Uzi said that shit earlier, right? But that's the thing. You're so, we're so prideful that we're not going to fuck with anybody. Listen, okay? You don't want to fuck with somebody's bread or get them in trouble or whatever, right? So instead what? We, we weaponize our communities so that they go against each other? So instead of 20,000 people watching all of us together, we decide to split them up into, into small little fucking pieces of the cake, right? You know what I'm saying? It's silly, man. It's silly, bro. We always keep weaponizing shit, man. Everybody does it too. It's so painful to see. It's fucking wild. What is this? Is this Korean food? You guys get what I'm saying? People keep weaponizing shit, bro. It's so stupid. I legit, man. I wish there was like, if there was one fucking admin who would be creeping around, lurking in people's chats and seeing what the streamer says, like that is a complete weaponizing bait to get their chat to fucking brigade for them. It would be over so quickly, dude. It Everything would change overnight. I swear to God. It's not an easy job. It's not an easy job, but shit, it might be better than this shit. It might be better than this shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? And some, and some, it, uh, bro, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. No, man. I, and I, and I swear to God, Chad, okay? I swear to God, some people are so good at it too. So, so there are some motherfuckers that are so good at weaponizing their chat too, bro. Like, don't get me wrong. Everybody does it to an extent. Like, I want my crowd to be supporting me right and then vibing for me and hyping me up and then putting somebody else down that's just normal human mentality but the thing is i i realize it when i'm doing it sometimes and i tell you guys to fucking calm down but there are some that just fucking triple down bro you know what i mean motherfuckers triple down and they love that shit i got a power bro i got i can get i can make thousands of people say something man especially when it goes on reddit bro did you see did you see the clip of Axel when they thought that Richie Revolver was arena reloading? The number of people that went into that Reddit post? Bro, that's, bro, it's like people were just waiting to release, man. You know, you know the first thing I did? The first thing I did, I DM Richie. I, my DM was beautiful to Richie. I said to the motherfucker, motherfucker, if you're doing that kind of shit in my crew, you're out. Motherfucker. Richie, I've never seen Richie just panic. Okay? And I said, if you're lying to me, bitch, I'm fucking you up. You know what I did? I went to get it checked straight away. I went to get it checked straight away. Everybody was doing it because when you have the extended mag, it does it automatically. You see what I'm saying? But people just so ready to judge, bro. And everybody's weaponizing this shit, bro. It's crazy. <coughs> it's, it's just mad to me, bro. It's just mad to me. I, I don't even know anymore, bro. It's just, it's just bad. Hopefully it changes for the better, but I don't know if it will. You want to know, chat? You're okay, okay. I'll give you a good example. When I, when I literally anal fucked the BBMC and like got their fucking hierarchy changed the first time we went into trouble with them. Okay. You, do you, do you want to, do you, like when Benji did that in character chat? Do you know how much PR Whippy pushed for me as a streamer? Like, to not get me any hate and shit like that? It's, that that's kind of like what you have to do for everything. And you got to be genuine about it. 
You know what I mean? And if you if you're not willing to put in that effort, people the drama's always gonna be like this, bro. He did it constantly, brother. Like he he would literally say like, if I get a single DM to Lysium or whatever, if anybody pisses my brother off and shit like that, he he'd get mad. He'd stop streaming, whatever. He said he said a lot of stuff. I don't even remember one hate message from that fucking interaction, bro. You know what I mean? Saying and what's the difference? The difference is the communities, man. The, the what people are trying to change is shit. We gotta put in the effort. I think every individual streamer that has a big following or a decent following needs to change something. Or else it's just gonna get fucked up. Especially if you know you got especially if you know if your audience is a little bit younger too. Oy! It's even heavier, bro. It's even heavier. <coughs> I feel like Buddha does a good job at it. I think but I think that's because Buddha just knows how to handle drama. He's been at it for a minute. Uh, I, I just fucking annoying, bro. Santi 